So instead of saying balls, you say now balls. Give me the, give me the ballsy balls. Give me the ballsy balls. Later. All right, this is Jungle Beast Radio. Australia's plug to the best music and hip hop in the world. Now, what we like to do also, oh, uh, what we like to do also is uh, put on unknown artists um, and review and react to them. We've been getting a lot of messages. We appreciate you guys uh, caring about our opinions and and uh, yeah, we get a lot. So please be patient with us. We're busy men. We're doing well right now though. His name is uh, Takir Ahmed, um, and he sent us a message back in January mm -hmm. and we're just getting into it now. He's a rapper out of, oh, an MC, sorry, originally from Bangladesh, currently based in our city of Melbourne. Well, and he asked yeah. us if we'd give us a listen and give some feedback. We'd be happy to. He's been a fan of us since, uh, he said, since seeing the RTJ reaction video, which is one of my personal it's, favorite it's, videos. It's my favorite video. Yeah, out RTJ3. Out of everything we've done, it's my favorite Yeah, video. same. Personally, I, because I have a lot that, of love for that That's album. the one that should have the most views and I, engagement, I in my so. opinion. I really think so as well. And it was until we dropped Pink Season. <laughs> <laughs> we just had to fuck it up. I was happy with those 10Ks and RTJ. <laughs> um, so he linked us to a song called Private Joker. Mm -hmm. uh, and his artist name looks like it's Mode Silver. We're going to link it all up in the description in the below so hit that if we're wrong it'll be down there right all right so mode silver and the track's called private joker all right here it is all right let's go i know artist okay. you have my attention Smartest other puts the pride in me. Wanna say it's spoke the truth, the other feeds the lies to me. One uses the eyes to see the beautiful, the other got him locked in every image that is known to be. You it's disputable. The wits out to follow in, the wits out to bottle up inside my hollow head. I'll try and show me what is real. I've been waiting. Yo, both sides got a role to play. Both are really close to me until the day I'm old and gray. Finally, when my soul escapes into the golden ray of light. Let me let me straight up shout out to the producers Atmosphere and Anthony Davis did a fucking fantastic Yo, job. This beat is not you don't hear it much. No, and I fucking love this Ever. type of production, man. And it has a very Reggie Snow feel to it. I don't know who he is. Um, it sounds very much like his Regevich, his first EP. But Reg, like even like the sort of the, the his voice way sort of flows. Very, it reminds me of Reggie Snow. Okay. But he's still like it's way different than that. This this guy. It kind of had an alien beat to it, like an outer space type of like, feel. It had like a little guitar sort of. Like yeah. Of well, he's like really high up on the frets. Man. Oh, he did his thing. I like the whole. I like the way the hook was going and how it was sort of overlapping that little bit. Really fucking and the, impressed. The verses were on point. Yo, man. I'm fucking. I'm. I'm gonna find this track. And I'm gonna listen to it probably quite regularly because that's how much I fucking like this song. And you, so we said about the consciousness. We talk about his consciousness in the end, and he's yeah. overlaying like a battle with my conscious, rattling my insides, all sort of nonsense. Yeah, and it's like, it's over the top, so it's like, the battle's like happening as he's sort of like, mm. trying to like, figure out what he's trying to grasp to. And they're using the production to, to kind of echo this, yeah. this, what's happening in the lyrics. Really fucking compliments it so well. And, I really, yeah, very, very well put together, focused song. Mm. And I checked out his page real quick, and the first thing I read is, after an incredibly long hiatus, I've decided to put a new song together. I wrote this between 2011 and 2014. Mm -hmm. song has gone through many iterations in that time. Since then, I finally got to the point where I like it. Hey, well... I'm glad you took your time, If man. you're doing one song every three years, I don't know if that will, fuck, that will work, <laughs> but... I liked the song a lot. Bruh, give me a four-track EP... That sounds very similar to the sound, and you got a you got a you got a fan. I really enjoyed it. I'm gonna check out more, and I feel like that if the listeners 
enjoyed what they heard too, they'll be willing to check out his, like, because we'll check all the links to the SoundCloud, everything below, so... If you like it, check out more of his stuff. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to do so. Shout out to Mode Silver, man. You did your thing. Um, if we have an MVP, like top artist, unknown artist of the year type thing, you be in the rankings so far. Most impressive unknown dude I've seen. Um, great job. Very focused song. Yo, keep doing your thing. You sound professional and yeah. You sound good. Yeah, man. I, fuck, I fucking like it. Really like it. Great job. All right. Next up. Next up.